is me, Isabel. Today I'm super excited because it's another Science Sunday. Today we're going to be doing a rotting apple experiment. What you will need four plastic cups, a marker, an apple, white vinegar, water, and oil. Clean adult supervision. What to do? First, label your cups, vinegar, air, oil, water. If you're using bowls, um, you should use paper to uh, label them. Next, have your parent cut and core your apple into four quarters. Next, add your apple to each cup. Cover your apples with your matching liquids. Here are our apple quarters all covered up in their liquids. This one's water, this one's vinegar, this one's oil, and this one's air. We'll check back to see how these rock and we'll write down our observations. Hey guys, it's, it's day three of our apple rotting experiment. This is how our apples look now. We're going to write down our observations in our journal. Hey guys, it's me, Bella. So it's been a week since we put our apples in, in, our, in the cups, and um, let's see what happened. So in this air container, um, I thought the apple would get all moldy, but instead the apple shriveled up. And in our next one, the water cup, the water has evaporated, leaving a part of the, of the apple sticking out, and it has that the apple has grown some green and white furry mold. The next cup we're gonna look at is the vinegar cup. And the vinegar has evaporated a lot. And what is really cool about it is that the vinegar took the color of the apple skin and it's turned brownish. And it hasn't changed size or, or got mold as far as you can see. So, the last one is the oil cup, and the oil has not evaporated at all, although it still has shriveled up, and there's like no mold or anything like the water. So, we took the apples out of their jars, and so the air one, um, it kind of is purple on the side, like, of the skin and it's all shriveled up and brown and the water one you can see it's all sludgy and the oil one is all greasy and kind of shriveled up and the vinegar one is brown and squishy it was so amazing that how the apples all came all rotted differently in different environments. If, make sure if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you did this experiment, you could share your observations down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you check out the link in the description box below for, for a more detailed tutorial tutorial on how you could do this experiment. Thanks for visiting us at, at Blooming Brilliant. Bye!